Hello friends, Brent Holverson here, uh, Regional Manager for Heaven Hill Brands for the state of Indiana. And uh, we have a treat for you today. We're here at uh, Goodfellas Pizzeria and Wise Guys Lounge. We've got Brennan back here and a special guest in Mr. Bernie Lovers, our Global Whiskey Ambassador. Got to talk to us today about uh, one of our new, new brands to the Elijah Craig family, our Elijah Craig Rye. And Brennan's going to show us how to make a uh, Elijah Craig Rye Manhattan. Bernie, tell us a little bit about what we got going on here. Well, just like Elijah Craig Bourbon, uh, Elijah Craig Rye has extra aged rye in it. So uh, eight year old and older uh, rye whiskeys make up the small batch of Elijah Craig Rye. And at 94 proof, has a nice little punch to it uh, for, for making a, a Manhattan. And rye is the perfect uh, spirit for a Manhattan, isn't it, Brendan? Oh, absolutely. Yeah. Uh, I mean, that's even the way that they used to do it back in the Prohibition era. You use an old fashioned, you make it with bourbon, Manhattan with rye. So that's a classic way to do it, and I think it brings out the flavors a little bit more when you do a rye Manhattan instead of a bourbon one. Cool, and you know, one of the ways I, I remember how I can make a Manhattan at home or a visit is uh, two parts of the spirit, one part of the vermouth, and a dash of bitters, and that would be 212, which is the area code for Manhattan. So see, you, it's the way I remember it. I need simple is what I need. And it's yes. actually perfect. It's, it's <laughs> like a simple, easy cocktail that you can make at home. Yeah. I mean, it's literally just gonna be, we're using the Elijah Craig Rye. It's just two ounces of that. And like you said, it's 2-1, so then you'll take one ounce of sweet vermouth. We use Dolan here. Two ounces of the bourbon, one ounce of the vermouth, and then a couple dashes of the Angostura bitters. And that's gonna get stirred. Two, one, two, ladies and gentlemen. That's an easy way to remember it. And again, this will be stirred instead of shaking because it's all spirit. Mm -hmm. And uh, then it's a, again that you want to have that ice be just to chill it down. Also, it becomes water when you're stirring it in that cocktail. And that is, I guess, the uh, fourth ingredient, if you will, would be the water. Uh, it just makes a great presentation. I like having a Manhattan up, which means not on the rocks. It's just uh, by itself in that uh, lovely glass there. How many times are you stirring that around? About 44. It's actually become more of like a habit now. I don't know if it's probably like 42 or 46 when I do it, but I've done it so many times that I think it's close. All right. But that is like the standard is 44 stirs. Strain that into a coupe glass and we'll add a sherry as well. That's about as simple as it gets and elegant. You know, it's easy to mess that drink up though, even though it it's, it's very few ingredients. Yeah. And that's, uh, it looks gorgeous. And that's the Elijah Craig Rye Manhattan. Thank you, Brent. Nothing like a little 212 and a little 317, right? <laughs> Cheers. Outstanding. Come and join us again for our next version of On the Rocks. We'll see you then.